All up in that ass, bitches. We're back. Welcome it's back to Secret of Evermore. Of ever Can we get more creative? Or more like Secret of Ever Bore. Uh, yeah, I'm about to fucking fall asleep, that's for sure. Because, like, we, we're we lost. Uh-huh. Mike says he found out where to go, oh, but I don't know. Where him. do I go? Oh, the, in the walk? Where through? do I oh, go? Oh, wait, look. My lovely. I want to know. I want to know about I your... I want to know. Are there strangers like me? I want to know what the strangers like me. What are you talking about, my friend? It's a Tarzan, Phil Collins. Oh, Jane in that one is... Jane, mm. Jane and Tarzan, mm. She's okay, but I never thought she I was like anything. her. A well, lot who's your favorite movie? Disney princess other than Ariel, Eric? Elsa, for sure, hands down. Uh, all right, all right. Uh, uh, Elsa and Anna on their knees sharing it. That's a good fantasy. Jesus Christ. Elsa's lesbian, Eric. She would never get on her knees and share it with her sister. <laughs> no, Eric. Mike, what about you? Well, now that we're talking Can about Jane, I kind of like Jane. I want to know are the strangers like me. Um, my favorite is Kyrie. She's a Disney princess now. Kyrie She's from... always a Disney princess. <laughs> She's from Kingdom Hearts. Oh. Uh, I know now that Kingdom Hearts is light. That's what he says at the end. The, uh, I always thought Jasmine was pretty hot. Jasmine's hot. Also, Tinkerbell is hot. Tinkerbell is so a princess. hot, dude. Holy shit. Meg? Or yeah, Megan? she's good. What are the fuck her name? Oh, uh, from uh, Megara. Hercules! Hercules! Her Hercules! Hercules! Oh, look. We did it. Did you do it, though? Yeah, look. I'm not controlling this. You can't hear the <laughs> click clack of my mouse or my keyboard, Mike, I mean. I can. Don't lie to me. So tell me, Mr. Dripper, what do you think of my new castle? I like it. It's really clean, immaculate, spotless, without flaw. Yeah, sure, I guess. Wow, it is, well, past time for the main dish, don't you think? I run a tight ship here, and I don't like to wait. What well, can be taking so long? Pig dog. Where's my meal? Pig dog's just gonna jump on the table. I knew it. Wow, I called it. And he ate this everything. This is an outrage. Who is responsible for this filthy beast? Mm -hmm. And then Thanks. you gotta fight. You gotta this. fight the fat queen now, or what? Uh, maybe. That'd be funny. She just like absorbs. She like gold dans all of her servants and just drains them for power. And then you have to fight her. Take Pretty them much. away as he very slowly walks over. Okay, buddy. <laughs> Had your fun. What? That's that guy talking now. I know. And then, <laughs> now they're like, "Do you want to save your game?" Oh, that's a funny. That's a. That's, that's hilarious. A, that's a funny. That's a funny joke. That's a thigh slapper. Because <laughs> because you're getting arrested. And that's why. You want... <laughs> that's what you say. <laughs> oh. I want to call my lawyer. <laughs> uh... Why not just kill them? I don't know. Yeah, they're just computer programs. Like, what, what does it matter? Can he fit through the hole? Uh, it's a glory hole. You were in there for like five seconds. Like, literally, yeah. Like, he's like, oh, thank God we're out. Like, we were... <laughs> There's something in there. He's sniffing, but I don't... I don't know. But I don't care. He's sniffing that Lock. taint. Oh. Old enemies, Eric. You remember that from Prehistoria Land. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Purple dinosaur. What is this, Barney? <laughs> 
Eric, you're wet. Don't ever let anyone tell you you're not funny because you're a funny guy. <laughs> He's so funny. He's a funny guy. He's a Whoa. funny guy. Yeah, this guy's like a boss, dude. Did you see how much damage he did, though, your dog? Yeah, dude. He's a funny guy. He's my favorite human of all time, so please don't make fun of him. He's a funny guy. You sound like uh, the please don't make fun of Brittany person. She's a person. That idiot I like, like, I like under the sheets. I was in I high like, school when that movie, that video came out, man. I like the South Park episode about Britney Spears. Uh, it's kind of sad. Yeah, it is, but it's enjoyable to watch. Poor Britney. Uh, now poor Miley Cyrus. She's the next one. But Miley Cyrus, um, she came around though. She's like back to being a normal human. <laughs> I don't think she was never ever like too outrageous though. I just hated when she outrageous. went through that. I just hated when she went through that phase where she, every picture she would have her tongue hanging out. Yeah, I was literally just going to say that. It was like, like just yeah, put it back in your fucking again, mouth, girl. God. Again, that's, that's not like going too far. That's pretty no, That's pretty out there, dude. Are you kidding me? No. Having your tongue out <laughs> in a picture? I know. Disgusting. Like next thing you know, people will be smiling. Be eating dinner at 10 o'clock at night, but... I don't know, I just thought she looked stupid as hell, like, when she did that. I was like, look at me, I'm such a bad girl. <laughs> but then again, I'm not easy. the Miley Cyrus you ones, no. The only uh, thing it was good for, it was easy to imagine you mouth. Yeah, um, we didn't hear that, but... Yeah, we, I'm so glad it could cut out, yeah. We, we know what you're saying, yeah. Eric. And, uh, we're better for not hearing it. <laughs> Where are you going, Mike? Oh, you made it. Gonna get some mushrooms. Mushrooms. <laughs> yeah, I just thought of. <sighs> You're gonna trip balls, son. Yo, I'm already tripping balls, man. I'm in a fucking computer program, man. It's like the fucking. What are you, Neo? He's he's running through sludge in a computer program. I just learned kung fu. Whoa. Whoa, man, Kung Fu, man. Are you going to uh, do this all over again? Um, apparently he took huge pay cuts so, like, the staff could, like, get paid more and shit. Apparently Keanu Reeves is, like, oh. like a, an amazing person. You didn't set that up well enough because for a second I was like, what are you talking about? Um, I know that yeah. the cast of The Big Bang Theory all took pay cuts so that like the new actors and actresses that joined in later seasons uh, could have their salaries increased. But like the main um, cast, yeah. they, they all have like, they all have the same salary. They're like, we don't want to get paid more than like no one gets paid more. Sheldon doesn't get paid more. They all get paid the same amount. What are they, communists? Uh, essentially. <laughs> if Sheldon's the cash cow of the show, he should be getting paid the most. Sheldon is like, oh my god. When they made Sheldon, they really just hit writing genius. Much like the genius of his character. Uh, they... Bazinga. Whew. Oh, anytime he says Bazinga, I piss my pants. Is that show finally over? Or is it still going? Uh, no, it's still, still going. going. They even wow. made a they made they made a new spin-off show called Young Sheldon, where it's Sheldon growing up. Yep. But the main show's still going on concurrent mm. with the spin-off, like at the same time. Yes. Wow. That spin-off is gonna get canceled pretty soon. It is not gonna do well. Oh, uh, let's see. Young Sheldon ratings. Young Sheldon ratings. So we broke out of jail, and the guy's like, "All right, time to go see the queen." It's like, oh, okay. Yep. Wow, what a bitch. 
Right? Also, from front on, she looks like a man in drag. <laughs> Another castle in the kingdom. That castle, Ebon Keep, is her former home and it's filthy. That's why I had this castle built and moved the kingdom across the ravine. A few stragglers um, remain in the other castle and this annoys me to no end. I want to remove them and you can help me do that. The entrance to Ebon Keep is the other side of the chessboard plateau. But the drawbridge on the other side is now up locked. What we need to do is go down to the ravine and come up the other side and open the drawbridge from within. Then my people will march across the ravine and take Ebon Keep by force. Can Young you Sheldon is getting pretty good reviews and pretty really? good ratings actually. No way. Yeah, Young Sheldon makes ratings history even as a network sitcom seem on death's door. It's only because it's initially like... Oh. That's did creepy. That, did that jester hang himself? It's a, it's a puppet. Um... It's only because it's a spinoff. Right? Um... Yeah, I mean, give it give it an entire season and then check yeah. the ratings, but uh, the I initial mean, it's, nine, react. it's nine episodes in, and uh, the ratings have been pretty good for it. So yeah, but it, it's not gonna do. Come on, you know it's like, not gonna do well. Like why why are you hoping for it to fail? Because it looks fucking absolutely shit. The Big Bang so Theory itself is it. shit. You're not watching it, so what does it matter? Why don't you let people enjoy shit? Like, literally, like, people at work are like, it's a funny show, Michael. And I'm just like, no. Why, why can't you let people enjoy things? <laughs> like, sure, I guess, but like... I, guess, I can't argue with that, I guess, you know. Watch terrible TV. You know that's why that's <laughs> no and no no and that's why no and that's no and that's why again. that's why TV gets worse and worse and worse as the years go on because the standard is just lowered and lowered and lowered because people are just like he said bazinga. <laughs> I mean that's why that's why cable I think is going down but like Netflix and Hulu originals are amazing like. They get good ratings, and they're like Stranger Things is one of like the big. It was the biggest show for a while there. What's so, so strange about it? His penis. See, and then you're just trying to ch ch change topic because I'm not you know, changing the topic. I just made a dumb joke because of Stranger Things. His thing. Anyways, yeah, yeah okay, it's so... a group of people with deformed penises. But, but like, yeah. okay, no, but, like, even so, like, that just kind of proves my point of... I well, was if, mostly if talking... If people are gonna watch shitty shows, let them. They'll, the shows will die out. Will they? Because I'm pretty sure well, the that, Big Bang that Theory that is not dying agree. out. That I don't necessarily agree with, because look at how shitty Top 40 music is these days, and it's because Clear Channel owns like 90% of the radio stations in North America now. So if they decide a song is going to be a hit, it will be a hit because they'll play it on every radio station that they yeah. own. See, I don't think so because Joji, uh, Filthy Frank, like he has hits and you don't hear any of his music on the radio. But that's... And he, he has like Billboard, or not, maybe not Billboard, but like on Spotify... He he was holding like the number one spot on Spotify for. A I'll month give you that. Like that that is the good thing about the internet is it's providing an alternative. Internet, yeah, it's providing an alternative to like, um, I guess for lack of a better term, like the corporate mainstream. But the issue is, is that over time, it's slowly just going to become to the point where, and it's already happening like this to the point where the internet stuff is just going to be controlled by big names and it's all going to become one big incestuous family like Hollywood is and, and shit like that. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, no, there are there are people like Joji that make it, but that's one in a, in a million. Rich Chiga, there's another one. Like, do you remember Post how... Malone, uh, you remember another another one. Okay, but that's, that's through the internet, but my initial point was cable TV is getting shittier and shittier. But do you remember how when the whole Susan Boyle thing, when she like came up on Britain's Got Talent, she's like, I'd like to be a singer. And they cut to all these millennials 
like audience. these what the fuck look on their face because it's like they've actually been bred to believe that you have to look like some like fashion model to. Have if anyone fucking thing. believes that they're an idiot okay I don't think anyone's bred to believe that dude as recently as as recently as the 80s didn't have like some pretty boy bitch to be a successful singer, but it's Cindy all about Lopper image isn't now. the fucking most, you know, pretty woman out there, and she was fucking hugely successful. Who? That's the eighties. Cindy Lauper. That's yeah. the. 80s. You just said the eighties. I said as that's recently what, yeah, as the eighties, you didn't have to be yeah. a pretty boy bitch to be successful. Things are things are different, and things are getting more and more shallow. I think you two are just super like what what are pessimistic view on the world. So the big big um, names right now are Lil Pump and t what is their name Tan Tana Monagu, and the songs that they produce are all fucking shit, but they're mainstream and people love it. I, I listen to the radio and I have never heard a I've fucking never heard Tana of of those song. I've never heard of Tana Montague song on. Yeah, well, I, that's it's a little pump is on. Like Gucci Gang is on, but that's like the only little pump song. And um, sorry, just let me just do this real quick. Whoa! Holy fuck! Why the fuck wow. are feathers so expensive? Oh, I, I just, just fucked us, boys. I just googled Lil Pump. What's what's his CD called? Stupidest looking idiot. Jesus Christ. So that's that's no, but that's they're they're, they're like they're like mainstream internet bullshit, dude. Through 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 Instagram and SoundCloud. Oh, see, Instagram is is even because it's literally just attention whore. That's all it is. Yeah, it's it's a fucking it's it's why I deleted it. It's the problem. I don't I don't totally I don't garbage. think I have a jaded look on things because I think that I think you do. I think you're super pessimistic about society. I just I I'll, I'll cop to that. I'll admit that. <laughs> I don't think I I don't think I do. I think I have a pretty rational look on it because if you look at TV shows, like, the best sitcoms are, like, from the 90s. They've only gotten shittier within well, my lifetime. In, yeah, but, yeah, but in that, that is so much to, to argue from a different point. That, I think, is not so much to do with... Uh, that, I think, is because, like, things go in and out of style, and I think sitcoms are at a low in popularity right now. Yeah, that's like, you remember how you remember how 15 years ago game shows all of a sudden became huge again, and then they died out? Like, things go yeah, in and out yeah, of style. Yeah. I just think... I don't know. I just... Things are just stupider now. Not stupider, but just more... Well, things are more superficial now. Yes. I'll say that. That's yeah. the way I would. So I don't think sitcoms like not there. There weren't just the best in the '90s. Like you still have Sunny in Philadelphia, which is fucking hilarious now. But it's different. It's very development. It's very different. The and Office is good. That was pretty recent. Yeah, and it almost fucking failed. Didn't it fail and then got brought back due to strong DVD sales, just like Family Guy. No, uh, they introduced uh, Danny DeVito, and he basically like saved. Oh, that I, th show. I thought you were talking about Arrested. Arrested Development, I don't think it's funny. No, Arrested at all. Development uh, got bought by Netflix, and Netflix made its own series on it. Uh, or, or continued one, the series. One, one season? Uh, I think two. But then, I mean, you have show. I mean, I guess not sitcoms, but like shows like Game of Thrones, which. Game of Thrones is like the biggest show in the world, and then you again, doesn't you necessarily mean it's the best show, though. It's a pretty fucking good show. Like, you don't become the best show by being shit. Let's let's not get started on this because Game of Thrones fans 
Um, you can't oh yeah, judge a there. show by its fans. If they perceive, if they perceive that's unfair. No, 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 no. I'm that's saying not what that he's saying at all. I'm, I'm saying if they perceive that somebody is like insulting the show, they fly off the handle. Because I have a friend like that. I also have friends like that. <laughs> from what I see, from what I see, what are the biggest things? A lot of it is just really fucking shitty. Well, listen, this is this is the final thing I'll say on this. We're getting like into like some weird territory here, but my personal view is I don't care. Like, I think people should like whatever the hell they like. But yeah. if I meet somebody and all their interests, like music, movie, TVs, if all their interests are simply what's popular at the moment, then I kind of view them as somebody who like is told what to like rather than actually liking what they like you know okay so today um a girl at work her ex came into the restaurant and they were all laughing at him and one of them made a comment like yeah i knew he was fucking ugly and lame when he still has a man bun and i was like well two years ago you, you would have thought that was that. that was yeah. that was hot because it was in and i was like what does it matter if that's still in style or not and i'm just not a person that just falls into that way of thinking and i don't think that's being pessimistic no i get, i get what you're saying yeah Garrett? I guess he's mad. Garrett. <laughs> <laughs> so I just beat this boss and that's that part. He looks fucking weird. It's like a... chess man? Something like that? I don't fucking know. I hate those night helmets that are like pointy night helmets like that one. Like a bird Looks beak? Stupid. Yeah. Well, he's like riding the point. That's not really like he's... it's his nose. Oh, he's riding it all right. Oh, he's riding it all right. Get him! There we go. Alright. Nice. We'll see you next time. Bye.